Hey beauty, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to be partnering with Walmart to bring you all new summer fashion finds. If you are new to my channel, my name is Deandra. I do post lots of Walmart fashion hauls. So if you enjoy shopping Walmart just as much as me, be sure to hit that subscribe button down below and your bell notification so you don't miss any of my content. I have been recently posting more casual, behind the scenes kind of vlog videos and I did share an unboxing of mostly everything that I'm gonna be showing you today. So if you want more sneak peeks like that, don't forget to check out the vlogs as well. I did go ahead and style everything head to toe Walmart fashion as much as possible, which I am actually wearing Walmart fashion right now. I will leave all the links in the description box below. I do wanna go ahead and start with accessories because I did mix and match all of them with with everything that I actually tried on, starting with their beach hats. I did actually get two and they are both so amazing. This one I debated really hard for a while if I should get this colorway or the one that has the black, which is also very, very cute. I went with this one because I got a beach bag that I thought could match up perfectly. The inside is adjustable so you could pull it as tight as you need it. It is a one size fit all option. And then this one I thought was so cute. I went with the black one cause I did like the tortoise shell chain detail, but they also had one that was a tan with like sort of a peachy pink chain detail, very similar to this color. And I know that they had one other color. I wanna say it was like maybe a cream chain detail. I went with the black because I thought it would look so chic with like a big pair of black sunglasses. This one is also adjustable on the inside. And when I was browsing, I did notice that they brought back the woven straw visors that I do typically buy every single year. And they had some really cute baseball caps for the summertime. I know I saw one online that said like Lake Day vibes or something like that that was really cute. I did end up only getting one beach bag, which I'm kind of sad about because as I was styling, this video I realized that I probably should get more of like a neutral one but I just fell in love with this one I loved the starfish detail it does actually have some seashells sewn on right in the middle and some little sequins on the starfish I also really loved the coral and pink colorway of this and like I said I did grab this hat to match because I thought it would be a cute pop of color moment with a neutral outfit. It does also have this really cute like twisted rope strap. The inside is lined with sort of like a waterproof feeling fabric. Definitely a great bag to keep your towels if you're going to the pool or the beach. It does actually have a zipper pocket on one side and then on the other side it has two basic open pockets right here and it does also have have a snap button closure. I am absolutely obsessed with this. I think it is so cute. Moving into shoes, my personal favorite of all the accessories. And that definitely shows because I grabbed one, two, three, four pairs of sandals. I just couldn't help it. And with the Walmart prices, it's just like, how could I not? you know i'm actually gonna start with my favorite pair by no boundaries i love the crochet detail it's very trendy for 2024 you'll be seeing this crochet pattern everywhere also it is a platform which again is very trendy for 2024 i love that it's a nude like super light tan color because i was fully expecting these to be white they looked so good with so many of my outfits you wouldn't think so because of all the colors but they actually really did. I did go ahead and stick with my regular size six in these and they fit perfectly. I'm gonna be wearing these everywhere. And then I did go ahead and grab this basic pair of nude flip-flops. I love that they're a faux leather. These are actually by Time & True, which all of the Time & True shoes always have memory foam insoles, and this one does as well. I did also grab it in my regular size six, and it fits perfect. 
and I think these are only like eight dollars. The next pair of Time and True sandals that I picked out was this one. I feel like these look so high end, especially with the stitching details. These also did come in a black version, which was very, very cute. And they have a memory foam insole, which is pretty much standard in all the Time and True shoes. I, again, did grab my regular size six in these and they fit true to size. They were very comfortable. I also love that it is a square toe detail. It does have a little stacked heel moment on the back. Immediately fell in love when I saw these scoop strappy heels. They do come in other colors, but I don't have any gold strappy heels and I just needed them in my life. But they do also come in a black and a really pretty like baby pink color that has a flower moment on it. The heel I would say is probably like a three inch heel. It was very comfortable for me because these also had a memory foam insole. Oh my gosh, it's so squishy and very, very comfortable to walk in. These were actually by the brand Scoop, which Scoop is one of their higher end brands at Walmart, but you definitely get the quality that you pay for. They are a self tie, so you can tie them just around your ankle or you can style them tied up your leg, which I think also is so cute. Cute. They do also have a square toe detail and I did grab these in a size six. Again, they do fit true to size. Moving into the swimsuits because I know Walmart swimsuits are going to sell out overnight, I feel like. I want to start off with this beautiful green two-piece by Sofia Vergara. These are actually sold separately, which I do like because if you have a large top and a medium bottom, you could mix and match very easily. I did go ahead and grab my regular size medium in both and they both fit true to size. Let's talk about the top first because it is adorable. I love the twist detail and it does actually have a wire on the bottom, which I personally like because it helps lift the girls and have them sit nice and perky. As a mom of three, I definitely could use all the help I can get. It is a X back detail. It does have adjustable straps and I love the gold hardware. The bottoms are a nice high rise basic. The fabric is ribbed on both of these and it is lined on the inside so it wasn't see-through or sheer or anything like that. The back does fit as a full bottom. I wouldn't say that these are very cheeky at all. So I would feel comfortable wearing this swimsuit around other families at the beach without feeling like too exposed. Love, love, love this. I did go ahead and grab this black one piece which is also also by Sofia Vergara. Again, I love the gold details on the front. I think the tie up in the front is also really cute. It's adjustable to your bust size, but also if I wanted it to be a little bit more sexy, I could loosen it up and show off a little bit more skin. But if I need to be a little bit more conservative around families with kids, I could obviously tie it up, you know, just to cover a little bit more. The back is also an X back with a deep V detail and it does have adjustable straps. The bottoms, I feel like, are a full coverage, not cheeky at all, very comfortable, and the inside is also fully lined, if you can see that there. This one just looks high-end and chic. When I was shopping for this haul, I wanted to make sure that everything that I picked out could be mixed and matched, but also had a level of chic style. Like if I was a housewife, would I wear this on camera? And my answer is yes to this one. Again, I did grab this in a medium and for the Sofia Vergara line, I do feel like it typically does run true to size. The last swimsuit that I picked up was this one. I love that it's a one piece, but it looks like a two piece. I also love the pink and orange color combo. I think that's super cute. It does have a really cute texture on the fabric. 
and of course this o-ring detail on the top is super cute it does have adjustable straps in the back and you can open and close the top it does have padding on the top but you can remove it if you want to and then the back did have a full coverage bottom which again i appreciate especially for wearing around families and just being out with the kids. If you're a mom, you know, <laughs> but I do really love this one. I think it's super cute. I need to get into the little girls and boys section because they do also have really cute options for kids and even men's, like no lie, I typically get Josh's swimsuits from Walmart as well. But of course we need swimsuit cover-ups to match with our swimsuits and I did pick out two. The first one is actually by Sofia Vergara and I fell in love because it is a zebra print. I love that it is just a basic chiffon one size little rectangle piece of fabric just because I can tie it up several different ways. In this video I did mostly style it as a sarong around my waist because that's just typically what I would do day to day but you could also just like throw this around and kind of wear it like a poncho if you wanted i hope that's not messing with my microphone but you get what i'm saying like just throw it over your shoulders and it did look good with both of the sofia vergara swimsuits that i grabbed so yeah i'm very happy with this then the next cover up is by time and true i did end up getting this one in a medium i love the ruffle on the bottom look at the crochet details that go throughout it it has the two stripes on the front it also has that crochet along the bottom where the ruffle is and the sleeve. I just think that this is adorable. It is a lightweight fabric. I feel like this one looks so high end. If I went into a department store right now, I could probably find something very similar to this at a way higher price point. Next, I want to talk about these linen trouser shorts, also by Time and True. I did grab these in a size small. I ended up wearing these as a swimsuit cover up in a lot of this video because I did mostly buy swimsuits, but I would totally style this day to day with just like a basic tank. Bright neon colors would be cute. You could do whites, blacks, so many different options. These these also did come in a black and a neon pink colorway, which they were all so cute. I think these were only like $16. I love that it has a tortoise shell button. It does have slit style pockets and it does have two pockets in the back with the tortoise shell button as well. They are a long line short, but not too long. I want to talk about this little tube top that I ended up styling with the linen shorts. I was very, very excited for this one. It is a really thick, almost like scuba feeling fabric, but it's also like a cotton blend. It does have padding for the boobs and a built-in bra, which I love, but it doesn't give me an option to remove the pads, which I'm just gonna have to cut a hole and remove them myself. But with that being said, this tube top did not cut me off like a lot of the tube tops that I've tried before. And I did appreciate the built-in bra because I was able to bra tuck it and it looked so cute once I styled it up. This one is by Scoop and I did end up sizing down to a size small and I definitely think that was the way to go with this one. It did also come in a neon green that I was obsessed with, but I just knew that I would get more wear out of the whites. Walmart comes out with some of the cutest crochet dresses every year, usually by time and true, but this one did end up being Madden NYC, and I am so in love with this. Honestly, it is sheer in the crochet on the bottom, so I did have to wear some nude Spanx underneath, but the good part about that is that you really couldn't tell, and you could also double this as a swimsuit cover-up because it is so lightweight for being like 
a knitted crochet dress. I really love the details right here in the neckline and I grabbed a large. I love this coral color. I think it's so pretty. And again, it matched basically all of the sandals that I picked out. It does have adjustable straps in the back. It does have a side slit that's not too high. I probably could have taken a size medium, honestly, because I did notice there was extra room Room right here with the large but I feel very comfortable in the size large I don't feel like too tight and restricted of course I did want to mention this really cute pajamas this one's also by Sofia Vergara and I did grab my regular size medium I did go ahead and try this one on with a bra because this part right here is a little sheer but that's okay I think that makes it super cute it does have a crisscross back and it is so soft. It's a nice lace fabric that's lined super soft on the inside with a satin bottom. If you want something a little bit more casual, they did also have a two-piece pajama set that was so cute. Don't skip the pajama section at Walmart because I always find all my favorite pajamas there. Oh my gosh, I totally almost forgot to mention this necklace set. I loved these like sea green little beads and bonus it came with this little chain right here that has a pearl and the like snake style necklace that matches all of my sets I can never have enough of these like every other section that I talk about don't skip the jewelry because they have really great jewelry at such good prices normally their earrings by time and true are like three dollars this probably was like six dollars and I got three necklaces I can mix and match them because they are actually individual necklaces and I think it is the perfect little summery beachy set. That is gonna complete today's fashion haul. I really hope that you enjoyed. I do plan on going back to Walmart because I know they're dropping more fashion as we speak and also Walmart is selling out as we speak. So if you liked anything that I shared today, be sure to check out the description box below. Give this video a thumbs up so you don't miss more of my content. And don't forget to hit that bell notification since you're already down there subscribing. Let me know what kind of fashion haul you wanna see from Walmart next, because I know I did more of a resort style haul. Maybe I should do some summer basics because I have been seeing lots of cute basics pop up in store. So let me know in the comments below. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.